Hi, I'm Corey. Hey, I'm Johanna. And welcome back to CNJ44. Hey, you'll either like us. Or you won't. Hey, you might not. What else? It's all good. We hope hey, you do. Hey, uh, Johanna. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Yeah, yeah. and guess how we're celebrating. N not Mexican style. We're <laughs> not, not Mexican. We're actually going Chinese. We're going Chinese. Yes, we are. Um, and, yeah. Um, for reasons we have no idea. Yeah, uh, we don't know. We, but uh, we, we decided... Know, I can make killer Mexican food, too, but... I don't know. Uh, she can make any killer food. Yeah. Uh, but we thought we'd do another blindfold challenge. Because we had so much fun with the last one. Exactly. And right. I thought you guys did, too. Um, and... Uh, let us know if we didn't. <laughs> yeah. Well, Anyways, too late, because <laughs> you already got another uh, one. Yeah, here, here you are. I bet here, be And here we are uh, with plates of Chinese food. That's right. And but... uh, and John is going to do a, a taste test challenge of uh, high-grade vodka as opposed to the low-grade vodka. Right. Uh, one, I'm, not a, vodka, one, I'm one, not a vodka drinker, so... One is Grey Goose, difficult. Johanna, which Grey is Goose. on the high end, it's, right? It's, it's, it's the good expensive. stuff. It's the good stuff. And uh, one is Gordon's Vodka, which is on the... Gordon's Vodka. It's on the bottom shelf. That's, that's a low It's brow. on the bottom shelf. That's um, a low brow. We have, we have had Gordon's in the past. Of course. Um, so, Cheap vodka. Fuck it. So, um, instead of doing a straight-up taste test and make it more difficult for Johanna, um, because she's not going to be blindfolded, um, no. obviously, because the drinks look pretty much identical. They look uh, the same. Yeah. Uh, we're going to find out if you can tell the difference. Right. Um, High end versus low end. But before that, uh, I am going to see if I can tell the difference between uh, a Chinese food restaurant in New England and Johanna's homemade Chinese food style stuff. Hence, uh, we've made uh, chicken fingers and egg rolls. Egg rolls. Yeah. Um, so I guess I got to put my blindfold on, Johanna. Right. Well, to correlate with our. With our Chinese food, we also made a mai tai. Oh, we did. Yes, of which course. Is, uh, we need to we need to test. Which is test Corey's it. Corey's go to drink. Uh, yes, when we go to a Chinese food. Chinese. Oh, and when, that's good. When we actually you did a good job on that. That actually tastes really good. It tastes that's, like that's pretty close to like what you get I, the Chinese I restaurant. expect to mai tai to taste. Yeah, like. oh, um, you did good, Kim. It's uh, light rum, dark rum, a little pineapple juice, yeah, a little orange juice. I had that was. I don't know if that's traditional, but I added uh, a little bit. And uh, a, little a little bit of green bean. Oh, it, it? it tastes great. Yeah, and it's garnished with um, a couple of cherries and a pineapple. Oh, yeah. yeah. I forgot about that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, I will. Um, <laughs> <laughs> mm. But yeah, so yeah. Um, these are traditional chicken fingers we get here in New England. I don't know if they're different. It's... It's pretty much uh, standard throughout the area, taste-wise. Right. In New England, yes. Um, yeah. But I think, you know, California and stuff, they don't have quite the same chicken. They probably don't yet. use MSG in California. Oh, we but don't have MSG in, our, I don't know. in ours either. We did not. Ours is MSG-free. Only because I was looking, I I was I, looking up recipes, right. and there was a... I should whatever. say yours is MSG. I didn't make any of this food. Uh, you, did not <laughs> make, you did not make any of the food. I didn't. Um, but you did I make the drinks. I did make the drinks. You did make the I did. I did do did. that. So, and, um, so that was good. So I'm going to put the blindfold on now, Johanna. Okay, um, nice. it's It's the jet blue blindfold because um, it's, the only one, it's the only one we got. It's the only one we have. It's the only one we have. But it works. It does because you know what? When I put it on... Can't see. I can't see. Can't see, can you? I can't. Really? Yeah, really. <laughs> really, I can't. Well, that's good. That's good because this is a blindfold challenge. It is. I, so I right. generally know where the camera is and I generally know where you are. So right. I know where to look. Right. And we thought we'd make this a little bit for you guys too because you're not going to know which one's mine and which one's from the restaurant. So. I have. I apologize. I had to adjust my blindfold. Was... Oh, you didn't take it off, did you? No, no, I did not. Okay. No, I just adjusted it a little bit. All right. So, um, I figured because they were finger foods. Man, it, smell, didn't... it smells good. I smell, I smell, uh, Chinese food. I do. I, I smell, I smell, okay. uh, duck Here's... sauce. 
here's a little napkin. That's what I smell mostly. For your, for your lap. There you go. Uh, what do you want to try first? Egg roll or chicken finger? Uh, let's go egg roll. Egg roll. Right. I'm thinking think egg roll because I am a huge fan of egg rolls. And I'm thinking this is going to be delicious. I don't like egg rolls. So... Am I supposed to pick this up myself? I know, I'm trying to hand it to you. Oh. Is this a whole one? Or is it a half it's one? a half one. Would you prefer a whole one? I don't know. Here, take this a whole one. This is the cut No, 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 it's no, cool. no. I'm debating. I'm debating. I just whether... wanted to show the filling. No, how I... the filling looked. Right? No, I think that's a great idea. I was but... just debating on whether I should take a bite out of the middle or the end. Good. Well, here's a whole one. Just take the whole one. No, no, I'm going to bite the middle part. I'm going to bite the middle part because I think that'll be a uh, more legit taste test because generally the end is mostly one done. Yes. So, here we go. All right. I took two bites. <laughs> That's all right. Mm. It sounded crispy anyway. Oh, super crispy, which is what an egg roll should be. Right, people? If you, if you get an egg roll from a Chinese place... It should be crispy on the outside. And this, to me, seems a little bit more flavor than I'm used to. But I'm going to reserve uh, my decision. I wanted to take another bite just there. But uh, I want to reserve, reserve my decision until... I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, right. Do you want to taste um, the next one? Have a palate cleanser? No, 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 no. I don't okay. think that's necessary. Okay. So this is the second egg roll. I this keep one? forgetting you have a blindfold on. This one? Like, why this isn't one? he taking it out of my hand? Because <laughs> I, I can't see. <laughs> yeah, I, I figured that um, out. Um, this one? It took me a minute. Uh, I, I'm supposed to be going by taste, but this one's fatter. It is fatter. Oh. There was something hard in there. Um, taste is good. Crispy on the outside as it should be. But this... I'm gonna like, like, I don't I'm like gonna, the I'm gonna sound like, of something was hard in there. And, yeah, uh, um, I don't know. That no, I makes down, that makes me nervous. A bit down. That makes and, me nervous uh, on something that was not the same texture as everything else in my mouth hole. Um, but this uh, I know to be uh, standard uh, Chinese food fare in New England. It didn't come from my egg roll. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Not, it did not. No. And, uh, Honestly, Johanna, yours, this tastes good. It does. And um, I can tell it's full of MSG. Oh, um, that's probably where cool. Yours was so much fresher, and um, the soy sauce in, in your mixture in the middle just came out in a great way. Thank it, you. Uh, it was a party in my mouth, and that was just like... That was just like, I'm drunk on New Year's Eve. <laughs> <laughs> and just shoving food. Not that mouth. we've never been drunk on New Year's <laughs> No, that's never happened. No, not even once. No. Um, but uh, I guess we got to move on to the... Uh, to this chicken fingers. Chicken fingers. And I think, All right. All right. I think since the first one, I, I think I'm going to nail the next one. I don't know if I've, I got it right yet, because John hasn't told me. Yeah, I just, I just did. Oh, you did? <laughs> <laughs> I just did. She I was did like, tell me. I was she like, yeah. Me and I, well, because there was something. I like, got carried away. Yeah. But one win for me, so I'm excited. That's good. Mm. I'm not, I'm going to take another bite, but I'm not going to say anything until I take a bite of the next one. Okay. That's fair. Hmm. It's good. It's good. It's greasy. It's crispy. Good. It's good and greasy. It's good and greasy. Good and, uh, what I would expect out of a Chinese chicken finger. Right. They're, <laughs> they're greasy and crunchy. And they're good when you're drunk. So. Well, these are... These are nearly identical. 
well in in crunch breading the only thing I can tell the difference is is the flavor of the chicken itself and um, this one tastes this chicken tastes home cooked to me and that's that's what I'm going by and that's what I'm sticking with but right. man these are damn close you're I right. was right. Yep. These were really, really close. Yep. I feel. I feel like I can take my blindfold off now. You can. Yeah. Hi, people. Hey. I'm back. I can see again. This was better. Wow, this food looks great on both sides. Thanks. Yeah. I. All of it tastes good. My egg rolls were a little thin, but I don't know like, how much filling do you really need. That's that's a lot. Of, that's a lot of filling. Well, I, I think I think their wontons must be bigger because the ones the ones you got okay. couldn't have couldn't. Well, maybe they could have. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But um, anyway. But you liked them. This was a delicious challenge, and I won it. Um. Uh, or I didn't even try the dipping sauce. It was it was both restaurant. It was both from it was both from China Walk here in Okay, Denver. both sauce. Uh, the sauce. It's, it's the same, same sauce. So it wouldn't it wouldn't matter. No, that's that's right. why I was like I just put it there because I figured you might have a couple of bites after you were finished with the challenge. Just saying. I might. I might. Uh, but uh, feel free if you want any more of this. I'm gonna save this blindfold because I might use it in another episode. <laughs> It's probably there's probably gonna be a third one, and if you guys want to comment and see what can I cook better, yeah, let, let us, us know. know we'll I, be happy to try I anything. I can. We have, we'd be happy to try anything. Are you gonna eat any more of that? Um, yeah, later. Okay. This this is for later. <coughs> yeah. Um, because Johanna needs to try some uh, Cape Codders, which is the cocktail that I have concocted for her. Yes. Um. Though, not traditional Chinese food stuff, but, you know, well, like we had said, it was about the vodka, and uh, I wanted to put right. a little extra flavor in there to trip her up a little bit. Yeah, because... Oh, John, it's straight you vodka. decide which one you want to try first. Oh. Uh, okay. In the meantime, I'm going to sip on this in my time. Please. I know, I was just going to have a sip of that. Oh, I was well, like, oh. here, I was going to sip out of your straw. Oh, I don't care. We reuse napkins and straws. <laughs> not toilet paper. Not toilet Still not toilet paper. No. <laughs> no, that's gross. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but, the drink, but the drink is good. It's good. Uh, All right, so I think I'm going to... Well, now I got the... That rum. really was. Now I got the rum taste in my mouth. Well, take, take, a, take, a, take a sip and cleanse your, cleanse your palate um, before you go into this All right. challenge. Because, honestly, I don't really drink vodka. No, she doesn't. It's gonna be it's gonna be hard for me to decipher. I think and it's gonna be, and that's why I that's why I went with it. Right. So, so here's to. Did you? Um, can I squeeze the lime? Oh uh, yeah. You, maybe you, I shouldn't. You do it however you want. If you squeeze that one, you gotta squeeze that one. That's all. Right. You want have real one. This challenge is on you. Now I'm nervous. Yeah, it should, it should be. <laughs> a, a cape cutter needs a little twist on. I don't um, really know if that's a fact or not, but that's I, how I like yeah, to Yeah, I don't know if it's a fact. I like that. You know, personal pre preference and all. You're not going to know until you taste the other one. Did you put vodka in this? Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's plenty in there. I'm just <laughs> You are funny. <laughs> Did I? It was no. just a joke. Uh, one's virgin. Not in this house. <laughs> no. They're, they both contain vodka. Um, the brand names the viewers can see, Johanna, before you tell... Before you take your guess, because I'm assuming it's going to be a guess. Um, the viewers can see... I don't know if you can actually read it or not. But, uh... Yeah, it was my handwriting. Sorry. It's horrible. But we didn't had have I done it in the printer. Had I done it in We didn't have any ink in the printer. We, did. So. we ran out of We're like, oh, we, shit. Why didn't we, we check that wall? We totally out. ran out of printer ink. Before we, before we went out. So we handwritten it. Yeah. In hopes that it would work on camera. Yeah. Uh, anyways. They're G's, people. They're G's. <laughs> They're G's. They are G's. Um, 
Honestly, I, <laughs> I, I really don't know. I mean, I was, um, um, I'm gonna, I'm me, gonna say, I'm well, gonna say. Before you, before, hold on, before you, before you take a guess, let me try both of them because I have not tried these and I do like vodka. And I prefer higher end vodka as opposed to the bottom shelf vodka. So, let, I'm gonna, let me see, because I already know, let me see if I can tell, knowing, let me see if I can tell the taste, if there's a taste difference, right? Because, why, I, why put, why put Grey Goose? in a Cape Cotter and spend more money when you go to the bar, right? That's true. information for you people. That's true, because, you know, obviously Grey Goose is a top-shelf vodka. It tastes good. It tastes good. It's a Cape Cotter. It tastes like a Cape mm -hmm. Cotter. I'm thinking this is the Grey Goose. Well, let me, t let me taste it first before I uh, let you know. People already know. This one's this one tastes a little harsh. So I feel like it's a lower you know end what? vodka. You know what? You know I could what? be wrong. You know what, Johanna? I don't know. Johanna. You know what? <laughs> Excuse me. You are right. Am I right? You are right. And you know what? I could tell the difference. Um yeah, it's a significant difference. Well, um, this one tastes legitimately better. They both contain the same amount of cranberry juice and orange juice. And, um, yeah, I could tell. You put I already orange, knew. You put orange juice in this, too? A little splash of, yeah, in both. Yeah, That's well, I cloudy. wanted it to be... That's why it was cloudy, I was like... Yeah, uh, well, I wanted to... Just a little traditional. Spice it up a little bit. Well, I know. So you made it. You made it like a firecracker. Yeah, like a firecracker. That's what. That's what I had earlier today because we had orange juice and curry juice. Yeah, when I was a little kid, we used to make firecrackers. I guess you could call it a firecracker. No, not a traditional Cape Cod. It's a. It's a spiced up. But you know, they were they were exactly the same as far as juice goes. And you can tell the difference. I hadn't tasted them before. I wasn't was really was sure. You. I but, really wasn't sure which was which, and I just Johnny, you deciphered mean, like, well, I think that yeah, but the you guessed lower, right. But you guessed right. You could tell and stuff. So. You could tell, and me knowing, yeah, I could tell as well. So uh, you're a winner, and you're a winner, and I'm a winner. And I really thought that and I was going to fail you, this you challenge. You guys are winners. I really did. You guys are winners so. too. Woohoo! Yeah. Winner, winner. Chicken, chicken dinner. dinner. Hey, it was chicken finger dinner. Uh, yeah, we had chicken finger That's dinner. That's funny. Um, oh. So, and you liked my chicken fingers. So, I, you know what? They were delicious. I feel they like super, I feel like if you didn't bite good. into something hard in that egg roll, you might have liked that egg roll better. Um, um, no, I could tell. I could. I could tell. The pro the prob the so prob like the problem pink. is like what is that? Had know. you actually put MSG in your food, it would have been harder to tell. But I think that's why Chinese why would food you add that? I well, don't know. Because um, well no, most people don't like it now. Everybody talks about it, but people love the flavor of it. And that's why all Chinese food restaurants use it. Well, you can ask for no MSG. You can ask. You can ask for no MSG. But to, but I feel like if I'm going to ask them for no MSG, they're going to spit in my food. Oh well, no. Or I'll do something. Like you just got to be nice about it. That's all. Sometimes um, anyway, I don't come Johanna, we get as nice Johanna. as I really am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, or is she? <laughs> anyway, uh, Johanna, we're going to end the episode by opening our Chinese. Uh, uh, fortune cookies. Okay. So you gotta open yours. I'll open mine, um, but I know I'll tell you I know you're gonna have a hard time reading it. So I, I won't will, be able to read I will read your fortune Not book. that I can't read, but I'm uh, blind. And I'm sure, I don't have my glasses. And I'm sure this is gonna be pretty lame, because these are legit um, These are fortune China cookies. Walk fortune cookies. From, uh, yeah, hey, from. has anybody ever played the number that they get yeah, on put here? that in the comments, man. Right? Have you and ever did you played win the anything? lucky number and won? Like you're playing Keno at the you Chinese ever restaurant. Have you the lucky number and won oh, off your fortune? Maybe that's just me. I don't know. I've never, I've never done it. And do you like the fortune cookies? Do you eat these, or do you just kind of? I do. I, I, I toss eat, them on the plate. I eat at least half of one. Yeah, I don't even know what's what's right side up and upside down. So, all right. So let me read yours first, John. Right, I'll take care of that for me. Um, 
Because you're the best. Johan's in waiting for uh, her new contact lenses, so forgive her. Um, so, Johanna, before you can do something, you must first do something. <laughs> That's so true, because tonight, <laughs> for so us to do this episode, we, we had, had to, to do, do so much stuff. Like, so much stuff. It's not an easy, it's not an easy episode. Um, well, for me, like, I have to cook Johanna, and clean. And... Johanna, you have to do a lot of work. And, and thank you, Johanna. No, that's cool. For giving me such a delicious challenge, because it was pretty great for me. Yeah. Be, even, I enjoy even being blindfolded. I, I like to cook. Even I like being to cook, blindfolded, so which is weird. It's and fun. It's weird and fun but, at the same time, so. Yeah, it's great. Um, and you know what, you guys, thanks for watching, because you do. Yeah. And. We appreciate we it. We really do. We really, we dig it. And, and we hope that. You know what we, what, you know what we also did? Doing these episodes. Yeah. So, regardless. So, uh, before um, before I read my fortune, I'm going to take a sip of my Tai just for posterity's sake. Posterity's sake. Posterity's sake. Oh, where well, that accent came in. But it came in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so be prepared to accept a wondrous opportunity in the days ahead. So apparently... That sounds awesome. Apparently, I have an opportunity uh, to look forward to. Yay. So, yeah. Little, wish me luck, people. And we hope you guys have great opportunities. Oh uh, yes, we too. do. We absolutely do because we love you guys for watching us. And yep, uh, thanks for watching. We love doing Appreciate these videos, it. so uh, that's fun. Yeah. So that being said, that being said, peace, peace out. out.